JJJ, you already know it's your boy Joe back at it again. Codingface.com, your boy is back and I done did it again. Listen, guys, I'm gonna say this. I want you guys to give yourself more credit. Give yourself more, you know, more to yourself, more credit to yourself. Like, you know, sometimes you may think like, oh man, uh, my employer is not, it's not supporting me. My employer is not. Um, how you call this like uh, doesn't care about me and and this and that and it's like yeah you're probably right <laughs> they don't care about you but you got to give yourself more right you got to know your worth you got to say hey man I don't need these people they need me that's what you got to think in your head as a developer you got to understand that you're somebody with a talent somebody with a skill you're you're not you know uh, Johnny Smith the the mechanic you know I'm not saying that the mechanic is anything wrong but you really busted your butt to learn all of this stuff and you either spent years or, or months to get to to this point where you at now where you're working with clients or working with a company and you know, sometimes they, they might not care about you. They might not care about uh, your well-being. They might not, you know, pay you what you're supposed to be getting paid. Don't worry about that. In your head, you got to think like, man, I'm not here, you know. I'm not here because I need them. I'm here because they need me. They need me. It's that simple. Like it or not, you don't really need any company out here because... To be honest with you guys, there's so many ways you guys can make your own money on your own without having to need to work for a company. There's so many different ways, man. You could be selling, you know, WordPress themes. You could create UI kits, start selling them. You can create uh, code snippets and, and sell those. You could create scripts and sell those things. Um, you could create a, a software as a service and, and that's it create your own company a lot of people do it the only problem is that you know a lot of developers don't understand how the business works you know people think hey I just finished uh, from a boot camp I should get a job hey I just learned all of this courses from Udemy or I learned it from Joe I should get a job hey I should go and and how you call this and I just finished college and I graduated I should get a job Sometimes you don't have to do that if you know how how to make money out here. You know, in in the sense of like like one, you could get clients, of course. Two, you could create your software as a service. Create like a, a, a cool a cool web app. You know, I see people on Facebook making so much money, just like on on little HTML5 games. Guys, that's not hard at all. Like, I'm telling you, you always got to think of yourself as an independent. You cannot think like you're going to be depending on somebody. You don't need anybody. You know, as a developer, you have a skill, man. Trust me. You got to give yourself more worth. Like, you know, you got to be like, man, I'm not worth that. I'm not worth, uh, you know. What twenty five, thirty dollars an hour? I'm worth more than that. I have a skill, you know. So you should get paid more, you know. Especially because there's so many companies that do want you. Sometimes you might be in a company that they don't want you, or they don't care about you, or or they don't appreciate you. You gotta be like, man, why am I here? You know what I mean? Like, why are you staying there? You don't have to stay there. There's a whole bunch of companies out there. Sometimes, um, you know, people is do things for fear. You know, they scared to go get a new job. They scared to leave and, and have to start all over. And, and whatever routes you had in, in a certain city or or a location, you already set routes and you're like, man, I don't know if I should leave and this and that. And like, no, nah, man, just leave. Stop worrying about it. You know, you live in a in the middle of nowhere in I don't know Cincinnati somewhere or Arkansas or something like that, and you're like, man, 
the most I'm gonna get is sixty thousand here. But I know if I go to another city, I'm gonna make a hundred thousand. If you really care about that money and your um you know your way of life is gonna be so much better, then leave. Go to another city. You don't have to stay in that town that you grew up in at all. You have to move, guys. You have to always uh, reinvent yourself and you know keep it moving. You know, that's why I always tell people, man, you just got to keep it moving, for real. Like, you just got to know your worth, man. As a developer, you have a skill. You got to think about that, man. You have a skill. Trust me. People want you. Stop thinking like, oh, man, I need this job. I can't leave this job because benefits is here is good and this and that. No, nah, who cares? Go to another job. You get other benefits, too, and probably even better. You know, you should never be stuck to anything, right? Never give a company, a client, an employer the power to control you. And one thing, too, guys, this there's something that I tell people all the time. Watch your finances, right? Watch your finances. Never get yourself in more debt than you need to be because then you become a slave to, to the system, then you get stuck to a job because it's like, let's say you buy a house where, you know, you know, the house is almost 70, 70% of, of your whole income. Well, 70% of your, your check goes straight to your house. That means you messed up. That means you completely messed up because now you're depending on that job. You can't leave that job. You leave that job. One month, that's it, you're, you're behind on your mortgage. Two months, you're behind on your mortgage. A few months, you know what I mean? Like, God forbid, you know, you, they're trying to take your house back, you know? But that's why you should never get into something that it, it, it's out of your league, man, because you become a, a, a slave to it, right? You know, even some people, they get into cars, and it's like when I, when I was about to buy this car, right? At first, I was like, man, I don't know if I should buy it because I don't like to feel tied down. And it's a, a big commitment. I'm paying almost $800 for this car, right? Now, the the year before, that, that was my rent. You know what I mean? So in my head, I'm like, man, I'm paying as much as I paid for rent last year for a car. But that's fine because I'm making that much. But I was about to buy a, a Maserati, right? That would have been $1,200 right per month right that would have been crazy now that i think about it i'm like yo what was i thinking uh, i almost got myself in in something that would have been like i don't know like half of my check per week like that would have been crazy you know what i mean so it would have been too much just on a car but you know, sometimes, sometimes we, we fall into that trap and then that's when you get stuck to a job because now you have all these bills that are depending on that job. You was basically um, getting things that are completely dependent on that income that that job gives you. So you have no flexibility. You can't say, hey, I'm going to move somewhere because you can't because now you're stuck. You got a house. You can't. Um, you try to get a, a job that's going to make you happier but they're gonna pay you a little bit less, you can't do it because you have so many bills on top of it, right? So, you gotta know your worth, guys. That's what I'm gonna tell you guys for this video. Know your worth, know that you just gotta be out here, get your skills, but know what you have, right? And do it smart. Don't be a slave to the system. Know that companies need you, you don't need companies, right? Uh, a lot of people, you know, employers walk around with this chip on their shoulders like they own you. And it's like, nah, man, like, are you crazy? Like, I don't need to be here. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> that's how that's how you got to think in your head. You know, like some sometimes a, a manager, you, you might see a manager, uh, let's say a project manager or something like that. And it's like they need that job because they have no skills besides a, a bullshit business uh, degree and then the only way that they're going to get a job is doing the same things that they they're doing there 
right? Which is just either in business or uh, project managing, but they have no skills. They, they can't just be like, hey, I'm gonna go independent. They can't open up their own business. A lot of these people, they just depending on whatever is there, whatever the company gives them. You know what I mean? So you you actually in a whole different situation. So you gotta know your worth, man. So yeah, man. I'll see you guys later. Uh, love you guys, man. Come to my website, coningface.com. Check out the courses that I have there. Trust me, man. If you've been trying a lot of places, you know, you've been trying a lot of courses, you're like, man, things are not clicking. Trust me, come to my site, things are gonna click. Trust me. Like, I've got a lot of emails from people like, man, you finally broke it down for me. I understand this. I can build my own sites. I can start coding, you know, JavaScript. Like, I break it down, guys. You know, it's not like I'm, I, I want to act like I'm the best, but I, I don't did something that's amazing now, guys. You know, we got codingphase.com. Check it out. Sorry, check it out. You know, give it a chance. Give it a chance. And. Like I said, give it a chance. <laughs> I'll see you guys later. Bye. You already know it's your boy Joe back at it again, man. Listen, make sure you subscribe and make sure you like this video, man. By the way, if you want to know exactly what courses I took to become a web developer, they're right there in the description. It's no secret. It's nothing crazy. It's no secret gift that I had. It's just pretty much I took the courses. They're pretty cheap. They're like $15 each on specials and just... Listen, man, change your life, change your lifestyle, do something fun and something cool that you could call a career. Bow.